Ireland on a zero after that defeat in Dublin this evening. And Ireland will head to Greece in June. Uh, France are in Gibraltar. But Brian Kerr, will Ireland head to Greece in June full of good heart after uh, an honourable defeat to the French this evening? What was your view on that, uh, that performance in Dublin? Well, in the main, we had very little of the ball, Tommy. Um, our only threat was down the right-hand side with uh, Chidozio Benny when he got the ball. A 1v1 against Hernandez, he, he caused a fair bit of trouble. Overall, I thought France controlled the game very, very well until the last maybe 15 minutes. Ireland opened up a little bit. They were quite defensive. Up until then, the shape was generally 5-4-1 with, with um, Evan Ferguson back deep in his own half, picking up Camavinga. But as the game went on and we were still one goal behind, we gave away another a soft goal again, trying to build her up across the back when um, Josh Cullen had the ball and made a poor choice of a pass to Jason I intercepted by Pavard and smacked it in there. Another shot from outside the box. Another shot from outside the box, a turnover. But late on, we had a fair bit of a go and Mignon was forced into a fantastic save from Collins, from a header, which was kind of a typical of what's happened with Ireland many times in recent years. We've depended on the centre-half, usually Shane Duffy or John Egan, to get us a goal when we needed one. Um, and it was, it, was, it was kind of battle and bite laid on with us. James McLean, the pitch, was, Alan Brown. Was it not better than us, Brian, in terms of how they used the ball when, when they got the opportunity, when the, when the French were were retreating a bit and 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 allowed us to to play a bit. Yeah, it was a, it was it was it was a bit better than that. But the end of the story is we lost one nothing again to France. That's three times in a row they've come to Dublin, and we've got no points and we have to go to Greece. And no matter what spin Stephen puts on it, we got beaten in the match and had very little possession to the last few minutes. Their goalkeeper had one save to make. Our goalkeeper made two good saves. Was well beaten on the goal. Maybe three saves. Uh, that was it. Um, and we've we've got to go on now. We've got to win matches in the group. I mean, overall, since Stephen's been the manager, we got three points in the first group out of six games in the Nations League. In the second group, he got nine points out of eight games. And then he got but, seven points. But I bring you in, Damien, on this now, because surely with the disparity of the resources that the two teams on that field this evening has, like, I know, OK, it's a defeat. It is, it is a defeat. And as you've said before many times, it's a results game. But we are... Ireland were uh, an amazing save from Mike Mannion away yeah. from an, an incredible draw against a team of vastly superior resources. It, it depends on, you know, which prism you choose to, to look at this, you know. Um, we're very good at valiant defeats and we're very good at, at getting points. We've gotten points over the years against Germany. We beat them against Italy. We're very, very good at that. We know we can do that. Back to the wall job, 5-4-1, very defensive, and then throw the kitchen sink at it later on. And we very well could have got something, OK? I don't think tonight or the night where Stephen Kenny's going to be judged, OK? It's the games where, you know, we were told we were getting a new Ireland, you know, the Latvias, the Armenias, and Greece away in June. I think that's where he's going to be judged, is those games. Tonight, we can pick our tactics, but ultimately France dictate that game. They were in complete control in the last five minutes. And the very fact that we got there at one nil meant we might as well have a go at it now, and we're very good at that. That script is written. We know what it is. June in Greece is where he is going to be judged. Um, I suppose my own personal opinion is I was a little bit excited when I woke up this morning, having listened to him yesterday. I thought we were going to get something different. I thought we were going to get um, us being a bit more adventurous, taking the game to the French, not taking a backward step. You know, the direct, the direct quotes were, you know, I'd rather not die a slow death. It was very slow for 85 minutes. If they got the second one, it would have been the slowest death ever. They were in complete control of that game. But they didn't, and we deserve credit for that. So I'm not, you know, mm. disparaging the team for that. The team done brilliant. The players executed the game plan perfectly. It's just I'm a little bit disappointed because I thought we're going to have a go at the French here, and we did in the last five minutes. I'm not expecting us, before anyone says that, we go open up and take the game to the French. Yeah, if, we, we, if, if we did that and, and got torn apart, absolutely. then you would have been but very the happy, critical, but the happy it? medium, the happy medium, though. You know, we had a lot of possession, but the amount of times in the game I counted where we won the ball back in good areas and went backwards, 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 went back to Gavin Bazoon and then went long, the French won it back. On top of that, you have to recognise the fact that we highlighted and everybody highlighted at the top of the game, the French let you have the ball. They're quite comfortable to drop into a mid-block and just say, have it, because that's their ploy, like they got with the goal. Have it, lull you into a false sense of security and in the main, 99.99% of the time, we were very good tonight, except that 0.1% where that ball got played square and Pavard nipped in. So... 
again, it just choose which prism you look at it through. And I think tonight it was a great result. The spirit was brilliant, but it was nothing new. We're very good at that. We've been doing it for years. In fact, we've got results against teams as good as France over the years, digging in, backs to the wall, 5-4-1. Just to reiterate, I was a little bit disappointed. I thought we were going to show a little bit more adventure. We didn't last five minutes, but ultimately, tonight is not where Stephen gets judged. June against Greece is... is, is, is. Did, did, 